Welcome back. My next guest tonight are the creators and stars of the critically acclaimed Comedy Central show, Corporate. Listen to this email and tell me if it sounds okay without exclamation points. I've attached the docs you've asked for. I sent them last week. I guess they got lost in your inbox. Anyway, let me know if there's anything else you need help with. Thanks. You just use periods? Yeah. Should be fine. I've attached the docs you asked for. I sent them last week. I guess they got lost in your inbox. <laughs> anyway, let me know if there's anything else you need help with. Thanks. Did you get Matt's email? This is an attack. Please welcome Matt Ingelbretson and Jake Weissman. Jake, this Hi. is crazy. I Thanks think we here. all wore the exact same color suit. Yes. And also, we matched these chairs exactly. This was yes. a huge mistake. You're just floating heads right now. <laughs> Your producer should be fired for allowing this to happen. How's everything over at Comedy Central? I've been over there a while. It's fine. Good? <laughs> it's, it's going fine. really well, Comedy Central. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah. Well, this is the this is your second season, right? Yeah. Second season of corporate. Mm -hmm. It's it's a it's a it's a, it, it can be a dark, uh, it's certainly a diff different uh, view of corporate culture. Are you anti corporate? Oh. Or are you listen, we're anti corporate on the show because that's what the kids want. You know what I mean? And that's what the democratic sure. socialists want. We want in with the cool kids. It's very important to us. But secretly, we love corporations. Yeah. Uh, we, we love, love CBS. Thank we, you so we much, love CBS. Viacom. Sure, Viacom pays yeah. for our show. Thank yeah. you so much. Yeah. And I mean, they treat people terribly, but they get us uh, products in two days shipping, and you can't beat that. <laughs> Yeah, That's true. and eventually, you know, they pay for the TV shows, and when the world ends, which we all know is coming, um, we're going to be in bunkers, and we're going to need TV shows to watch, so yeah. we're really thankful. Right? But you're famous now. Yeah, we're famous. We actually get recognized <laughs> all the time. Uh, now that you it's do? season two. Yeah, uh, yeah we, we live in Los Angeles, and people come up to us all the time in diners, and they're like, oh my God, there's uh, Jonah Hill eating with Tom Green. <laughs> I, 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 I get it. Yeah. I totally get it. Has that gotten you anything, like a discount or anything like that? No discounts. No. Everyone just wants me to quote Freddie Got Fingered, <laughs> which I've wow. never seen. So that, I is a, yeah. that is a deep cut. <laughs> <laughs> You've never yeah. seen Freddie Got Fingered? No. You lucky man. Is it good? <laughs> you lucky man. So, okay, so have you taken anything from your real life to use as material? Like, is, is what we see... Did you guys either ever work in a corporate environment other than working for a corporation now? But did I you did. ever did, like, you know, yeah, admin I got a, work or anything like that? Yeah, I got a business degree and an English degree, and so I did a Whoa, lot of... Whoa, a business degree and an English degree. Two degrees. Wow, hello, ladies. Not to brag. Wow. So what did you think you were going to do with your business degree? Business. <laughs> that was my problem. Is I got the business quite a, degree and quite I'm like, a plan. I don't know what this is. <laughs> sure, yeah. sure. So I came out here. Or I came out to LA and got jobs like copywriting and doing marketing and stuff, and it felt like I was ruining my life. And we based the show on that. Okay. And did but you, I worked did you have corporate for background. Yeah. Jake? No, not at all. I'm uh, making up everything. Yeah. I have no idea what I'm talking about, and uh, you're the first person that's kind of exposed me. Yeah. <laughs> Jake worked in a. Jake worked in a chandelier store for years. Sold chandeliers to really rich people who wow. didn't need the chandeliers. I don't need a chandelier. Sell me one. Sell me like, <laughs> sell me on like, what's what, what? What? How would you sell a chandelier? I need a light from my living room. <laughs> oh, so you like light? <laughs> That's yeah. good. Do you like expensive light? I like nice things. I like nice things. Well, then you should buy a chandelier. <laughs> Seems obvious. That's a soft sell. That's a soft sell. <laughs> Were you a good salesman? No, I was one of the worst salesmen of all time. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I actually, uh, I got in trouble all the time because I didn't care about selling chandeliers. You can't get amped up to sell lights. Like, there's just no, anyone, if you ever go into a chandelier store, just know that everyone there is very unhappy. Uh, you can't be yeah. excited about that. Yeah. I sold futons when I first got out of college. I sold futons. Sell me oh. a futon. I can't. <laughs> I was the top salesman and I couldn't make rent. <laughs> I'll tell you this futon. You know what the great thing about a futon is like, yeah. what do you got right? What kind of bed you got right now? King size. King size what? What kind of bed? 
Uh, I don't Coil, wanna... waterbed, what do you got? You, it's you got uh, a memory, memory foam mattress. Memory foam mattress. You don't want a memory foam mattress because it will inform on the authorities on everything you've done in that bed. <laughs> it's got a memory of everything <laughs> yeah. you've done. See, I want the authorities to know about what I've done in that bed. Oh, really? What? <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes I like to just be silent with guests. <laughs> I just like to be quiet with guests. You guys want to be quiet for a second? Yeah. yeah. Just be quiet. Thank you, Stephen. The season finale of Corporate airs Tuesday on Comedy Central. Matt Ingerbritsen and Jake Weissman, everybody. We'll be right back.